third graders. So today we're going to look at a poem and try to kind of figure out what is the author's point of view? What are they trying to tell us about and what does this poem mean? So the poem you actually have is in front of you or if not, you should grab it and read it with me. It's called The Raindrops New Dresses. The rain drops new dresses. So I already know that this is probably gonna be an entertaining story or an entertaining poem because raindrops don't wear dresses. And I also know that a poem oftentimes is trying to tell me something or share information in a exciting way. And that's what's gonna happen in this poem. So first we're just gonna read through the poem and then we're going to go back and talk about some of the stanzas and the lines. It says, we're so tired of these gray dresses, cried the little drops of rain, as they came down helter-skelter from the Nimbus cloud fast train. Then the sun peeped out a minute. Dears, be good and do not fight. I have ordered you new dresses, dainty robes of purest white. Ah, then all the tiny raindrops hummed a merry, glad refrain. Under umbrellas, people said, how pleasant is the music of the rain. Just at even, when the children had been safely tucked in bed, there was such a rush and bustle in the dark clouds overhead. Then those raindrops hurried earthward at the north wind's call, you know. And the wee folks in the morning laughed to see the flakes of snow. So let's go back and talk about the first stanza. We're so tired of these gray dresses, cried the little drops of rain. So in this stanza, the gray dresses are talking about the clouds. So the rain clouds are saying, oh, we're tired of these dark clouds. And the clouds they're talking about are called nimbus clouds. That's the type of clouds that rain comes from. It says, as they came down helter-skelter. That means like all over the place. Helter-skelter is all over the place, kind of crazy. Then the sun peeped out a minute. Dears, be good, do not fight. I have ordered you new dresses, dainty robes of purest white. So the sun is now telling them, don't worry, you're going to get a white cloud soon. And when that happens, something's going to change. So this is definitely a, an entertaining poem because the sun is talking in it, but it's giving us a sneak peek into nature, into the way that we might think of how the clouds and the rain and the sun all talk to each other in our heads. Then the raindrops hummed a merry, glad refrain. Under umbrellas, people said, how pleasant is the music of the rain. And sometimes that people sit and listen to the rain because it makes almost like a musical song as it hits, whether it's an umbrella or a roof or a pond or something. It makes this sound and people enjoy listening to the sound of rain when it happens, if it's just a pleasant rain. Then it's talking about nighttime here as children are tucked in bed and the clouds are dark because it's dark outside, but those clouds are being changed over here. And the last stanza, we see that those raindrops hurry earthward at the north wind's call. North wind is cold. So when that cold wind is hitting the raindrops, it changes them into snow. And everyone enjoys seeing the snow in the morning. So this poem is basically telling us all about nature and rain and snow and the sun and the clouds and how people enjoy the different aspects. But it's also just an entertaining story about what might be happening in the world around us. And it's very pleasant. I felt like the, this was a fun poem um, that kind of explained just the way that the rain would be talking to the clouds and want to change in the sun and turning over. So this poem is, again, talking about nature. You're going to be answering some questions shortly regarding this poem. 
think back to what we talked about, go back into the poem, think about what is the author trying to tell you. Remember we said it's about nature and rain and the enjoyment of the rain and how the rain turns to snow and then um, how everyone enjoys the snow. And so I want you to be thinking about that as you answer your questions today.